What's up YouTube, Hotsoup here. I'm coming to you with a video about the GE Force Game Ready Driver version 456.38. And this is the version that's going to give you access to things like NVIDIA Reflex Low Latency Gaming, um, also this Performance Overlay tab, and also it will give you um, access to this column here. So, what this will do is it will automatically tune your GPU to um, give you the max performance that it can. It's, it's automatic overclocking, basically. Um, and it does it all in the background and it'll scan every so often and make sure that you're hitting uh, the right targets, right? So to get this all set up, first what you wanna do is you wanna go into your GE Force experience and check for updates. Make sure that you have version 456.38. Uh, once that's downloaded and installed, once you have it installed, what you wanna do is you wanna go over here to the COG or the settings section and go down to the about and you wanna click enable experimental features. This will give you the access to the in-game um, overlays and things like the performance overlay and the uh, NVIDIA reflex. Um, also make sure that you have the in-game overlay toggled to on. Um, the hotkey, default hotkey is Alt Z. And when we go into this, you can see that you have that performance tab again. And what you wanna do is you wanna switch this to on, automatic tuning, or you can manually do it here too. Um, I'm just going to set it to automatic and leave it running for like a month and see if there's any discernible difference in my um, experience. And if you want this performance overlay on the side, uh, you can hit Alt R, which is the default. And if you don't see that, what you can do is under the performance tab, go here to the cog and it'll bring you to this screen and it says P performance and you can choose where you want it on the screen and you have a basic and you have an advanced option. So this will give you a little bit more uh, control and really pull back the curtains on exactly what your GPU is doing um, and CPU at, at what time. It'll give you uh, FPS and then render latency, which is their new thing. Um, so I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please leave a like and a comment below.